Hello everyone and welcome to The Vortex, where lies and falsehoods are trapped and exposed. I'm Michael Voris. Why does being Catholic matter? Well, ultimately, so you can get to heaven, but there is a real reason even in this life. You will have a better life, interiorly, in here, where life really matters. That's because when someone is focused on God and the faith, everything else comes into focus, and if you then follow through, you will have a happier life, here, on earth. All the drama and angst and anxiety and agita that comes upon every phase of life can be greatly reduced. The drama of relationships in our 20s, the drama of career in our 30s, the drama of failed relationships in our 40s, the drama of life itself in our 50s, the drama of change of life in our 60s, the drama of the end of our life in our 70s and 80s. Keep yourself squared with God through the faith and all of life's drama is greatly diminished. Most of us will always worry to some degree about money or relationships and all that, but it is precisely the degree of worry that matters. The faith makes all this more than manageable. It makes it all make sense. The faith steals you against life's disappointments. It makes you able to roll with the punches and set your heart on the things of heaven, which is, after all, all of our final destinies. And being able to look back and laugh at life's problems and realize that nothing on this earth lasts forever is a cause of inestimable joy. When I was in my 20s and the life and life was full of drama, a great priest told me, whatever ends can be lived through. He was right then and he's still right now. Only the Catholic faith can give someone that example and that lesson. This is why RealCatholicTV.com is so militant about the faith. This is why we call out people in positions of power in the church for failing to boldly and stridently advance the cause of the truth. Their lack of doing so not only robs their flock of joys in this life, but threatens their entire reason for existence, the next life. Theology, properly understood and lived, leads to healthy psychology and then eternal happiness. This doesn't mean that people are free from the results of original sin in their personalities. To be sure, all sorts of things, mental illness, depression, for example, can still persist in the soul even with its earthly eyes fixed on heaven. Happiness in this life always comes with boundaries, even for the holy and the sainted. What it does mean is that living a life according to the faith orients your psychology so as not to be destructive of yourself and others. Heaven is your goal, even as we slog through the pains of this life. Living the theological life makes earthly life bearable, even as we trudge toward heaven. We think that's worth fighting for. What do you think? God bless you. I'm Michael Voris. Please help us keep delivering these kinds of messages that so desperately need to be heard and acted on. Join RealCatholicTV.com today as a premium subscriber become immersed in the faith established by Jesus Christ. The Catholic Church is the only hope against evil because that is its God-given mission. As our Lord said, apart from me, you can do nothing. Join RealCatholicTV.com today as a premium subscriber and come to learn and love Christ more deeply.